Politicians are now busy in all corners of the country in search of votes, but how they do it is under great monitoring. It has been noted with concern that though hate speech has decreased, politicians have become crafty with words that may amount to hate speech or incitement. They are coding their languages, they are using stereotypes, they are using um, heavy vernacular uh, parables or proverbs that become difficult for police officers with whom we work or with the NCIC monitors on the ground to identify quickly as hate speech. So we have just completed a study and a research that will be disseminated very shortly in the media um, on coded language and stereotypes that amount to hate speech. With more people reverting to the use of internet, it remains a challenge on how to monitor politics on the internet. When people's speeches border on incitement but do not amount to ethnic contempt or do not amount to hate speech, what we have done is that we have sent them secession notices, we have copied uh, the information uh, to the police so that these people are kept on an increased radar. We have been able to categorize the, the, the messages in terms of hate speech and incitement. They are very clear. In fact, in the blogs, they don't even really use coded language or, or, or whatever. They are actually very, very clear about what they're saying. And uh, I believe that uh, these, if we really pursue them closely with the DPP's office, we can be able to, to handle. But you are right, there are no specific laws just now for Internet. Citizens have been cautioned on the festive season when crime incidences tend to go up. Both public and private motorists have been called upon to exercise caution as the law will take its full course with no exemptions. We will also have uh, many officers deployed in the urban centers to ensure that the security, especially of the premises, that will be left vacant. And even the rural areas, uh, all police officers will be on duty on 24 hours basis, patrolling the rural areas and ensuring uh, that uh, we manage crime. The media has been cautioned against biased coverage of politicians and political coalitions has been the case in the past two weeks. Henry Miner, GBS News.